Signor D, you gave us your word. You said that if we won, we would represent Italy. <laughs> As you like, but just remember, I am still your coach. I give you the chance to be the best, to fulfill my ultimate vision of what football can be. Failure is not an option, understood? Hey, wait! Paolo, a terrible! I have some awful news! Ciao, Giorgio, you have returned. What was that bad news all about? We just got a phone call. The Japan-Argentina match has been rescheduled for today. It's due to kick off any minute. What? <laughs> We will meet again in Azuma National. I will make sure of it. <laughs> Just when I thought Ray Dark couldn't sink any lower. Mark, you need to hurry. I'll show you a shortcut to the stadium. Oi, who are you? Let us through. Ugh. Caleb. No, uh, now we will never make it in time. We can't let the others down. I can't believe the match was rescheduled for today. Mac and the others still aren't back. What are we gonna do, Nathan? The ferry to the venue is due to leave. We've got no choice. We have to go. Mark and the others will make it. I know they will. There's nothing else we can do, is there? We can't pull out of the match. Now we have to play a match without our coaches or our captain. So, this gets to something very interesting. Mark, Sanford, Jude and Stonewall are unavailable. We cannot use them in the next match against Argentina. And so we have to build a team from scratch of 16 players using the people we've got minus those four. It's definitely a challenge to be without your best players, but it also means you get to use silly players that you might not have gotten to otherwise. So I'm going to build something that suits me. I will show you what the team itself looks like when it's a little more relevant. I when we're off the boat right now. <laughs> I'm actually playing as Kevin right now. I'm going to change that. There we go. I've managed to put a few people back on the team who were previously missing, such as Banyan and Thor, who can have this chance to rejoin the team while we are short of the more important ones. Also, make sure when you're at this point of the game, Put Darren Lachance in your team of four, because he's not there by default, and you do need a goalkeeper. Let's be honest. But still, we need to walk all the way to the Argentinian stadium before we can actually do the match against Argentina. But I tell you what, what an upset! Was it all Ray Dark that... Yes, yes, of course it was Ray Dark who manipulated the sketch. Hey. Well, that was worth showing. <laughs> the goalkeeper against me used Marge in the hand, and then we got Nathan Swift's victory animation, which we will get regardless of whether or not he's in the team, I think. I'll have an experiment with it in a bit, actually. 
because indeed, when in the absence of both Mark Evans and Jude Sharp, would you believe the third in line to be captain of Inazuma National is Nathan Swift? I certainly didn't see it coming, but it kind of makes sense. He's Mark's best friend. He's been there since the early days of Ryman. And I've just realised this is a don't let the team score challenge and I'm already letting them attempt taking a shot. Oh dear. <laughs> Never mind, I've, I've expired half the time limit now, so let's pad it out. So indeed, yes, Nathan will be our captain, which is why I put him in the team of four, but I'm also going to try swapping someone different in, just to see if there is anyone else who can have any lines. There we go. We didn't let the other team score. I think that's the first time I've included one of those on video, in all fairness. Let's give it a swip swap. Uh, swap out Nathan for, I'm going to say it ahead of time, the fourth in line captain of Inazuma National. Yes, they planned that far ahead. Xavier Foster is the fourth in line to be captain of Inazuma National. That's the level of preparation which went into this team, and great. It's another don't let the team score. I want to take shots on goal, man, to make this pathway to the stadium interesting. Get the random encounters done quickly. There we go. We defeated the Hatchet Men again. Can I get to the next part of the map? This is vengeance for the path to the England stadium where I didn't get a single random encounter. This time they're going to be non-stop especially in the one where it's actually a maze this time and takes some figuring out. What does this guy look like, Lenjin Gauger? What do you think his password would be? Is it Pumpkin? Yes, of course it's Pumpkin. That's like me setting my password as, I don't know, Swadloon. <laughs> it's just, you come on. You don't. Well, I mean, I guess it makes it guessable for the players who don't want to go online and look up what the password is. The correct way to go is up. I'm sure there's some goodies over this way. Yeah, it's the other side of the broken bridge, which I think is the Cosmic Blast. That's actually Janus's collab shoot, which he gets in Firestorm. Have I got any spare spaces in his moveset? Oops, did I show you my formation? Could be worth giving him a move which is naturally his. Yeah, I'll do that and he can have a blocking move when I get a good one to give him. So, um, where is it again? Cosmic Blast, that's a move that's rightfully his, so it makes sense on him. We'll carry on with the maze then. Item over here, item over here. It is Asteroid Belt. Well... All right, then, <laughs> let's just finish giving him the complete Alias Academy set of moves, then. He is a midfielder, so it makes sense for him to have defensive moves. When I can find him anyway, oops, did I show the biggest spoiler of all? Yeah, I'm, um, I'm gonna give the guy a chance, all right? He's not on my main squad, but he cries himself to sleep every night about not getting on the Unizuma National Squad, so I think Dave Quagmire deserves a, chan a chance as a one-off. We even got Absolute Knights, which is England's Take the Ball from If Thoust special tactic. They also have a second one, Invincible Lance, which I didn't really bring attention to last time. That was the one that they used to get up the pitch. We don't have that one again. The boy, he's now even got a name. Charlie is still calling his father an idiot. But anyway, we have arrived at Wildcat Stadium, where we will, in the next episode, take on Inazuma. It's another human healer. I don't understand these things. But in the next episode... Without our captain, without our coaches, without our tactician, we will take on Argentina. And I never actually checked to see if Xavier has any unique victory animations. So I might as well go to the bother of doing another encounter. Thunder! Beast! Even if it's not a Xavier victory line, it's still another Nathan one, because this is the only point in the game you can hear those. Let's show some off, right? Yeah. 
It's nice that they went to the trouble of including that. I appreciate it. But anyway, no more need for grinding unless I really want to level up Dave Quagmire. In the next episode, we'll take on Argentina. It's going to be tricky. Ta-ra for now. Heat in your heart, heat in your heart, the heat in your heart, it's like a hurricane. Okay, never let nobody get you down, yeah, you'll never fly if you always got your feet on the ground. If you need a helping hand, you've got two of your own. Get your friends together, feel the power growing and growing and growing. Oh, I know, it's hard to pick your head up when you fall on your face. But with the spirit to say, it's okay, try again. Pull yourself together and go, 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 go. You know there's gonna be times when things don't go your way. Keep fighting, tomorrow is another day. All your troubles, your fears, and your pain. Blown away by the hurricane. You've got the will to win, you're gonna do it again. With a striking flash of lightning, let the fun begin. Light it up with the fire in your eyes. Keep on burning till you take the prize. Heat in your heart. Heat in your heart, the heat in your heart, it's like a hurricane. Look, there's David Sanford in the opening sequence, therefore you shouldn't watch this before actually starting the game if you're a really attentive person like me.